The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United States Championship. The United States title has been taken to an entirely new level of prominence and relevance with matchups like the one you're about to see. That's true, Cole, but if you ask the champ, it was all his doing. A focused challenger about to compete in perhaps the biggest match of his career. This is it, guys. The title is up for grabs here. And this might be the most highly anticipated title defense in recent memory. As far as title defenses go, this is about as big as it gets. He needs to be on his game tonight. Introducing the challenger from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth. And his opponent from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 286 pounds. He is the WWE United States Champion, Brock. Forty-five years of history behind that, the United States Championship. The WWE United States title is on the line, a title with so much history. Well, the winner almost becomes the defender of the red, white, and blue. Well, that is, unless they choose to use the title to insult Americans, as some have. Hey, it's the title holder's freedom to do so, Saxton.
Great strength being shown here. Oh, 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 just bounced that face like a basketball. One after another. A oh, bear hug, squeezing the breath out of them. Give up now. A bear hug cinched in. Gotta find a way out and catch your breath. Look at this. No quit whatsoever. Raining down elbows and escaping the bear hug. Sling blade. Oh, what a kick. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. No, no. I can't. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Stomping. Ouch. And now he rolls out looking for a timeout. You don't get any timeouts in a fight. That's just running away. Oh, look at this. Raw power. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. Oh, he's got him up high. The fallaway slam. Belly to belly. The challenger's looking shaken. He returns to the ring. was coming there. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Oh, put down face first. Oh, look at this. So ruthless. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? A kick out before three. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Dodged right on cue. He's got him scouted. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. He isn't finding any space to recover. Yeah, and every attempt to fight back is being negated. Oh, man. He's able to sidestep there. You see, oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Oh, the heel hooks in. Well, this won't win the match. They're fighting out of it. Successfully does a couple effective shots. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. A backdrop suplex. And what a hit. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Great counter. Deep to side. Jeez. Just got thrown around like a sack of you know what. Somehow, some way. Uh oh. Batten down the hatches. Well placed elbow to break up the maneuver. Oh, right to the back of the neck. What a blow. Good night. He's got him in the crosshairs. Oh, here we go. Oh, stop. Gonna see a new champ. Cover. And they're still in this. What a display of stamina. The champ showing they are truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. He's reeling, slowly getting up. Set up for a second time. Oh, stop! We can have a new champion! Cover! The champ kicks out at two! I can't believe it! We were a second away from a new champion. Are we close to the start of a new reign? Throwing everything in the kitchen sink in there, but to no avail. Up high! 
Uh-oh, got snatched up here. Oh, sent flying. It is unbelievable what these athletes have been putting each other through. Absolutely pushing each other beyond any normal human's limits. Crank in the head. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. Oh, and a knee. And another. One after the other. Uh-oh. Fist directly to the gut. Going counter for counter. Now can it be capitalized on? What's coming next? Taking their time. Oh, punch to the gut. I'll take the wind right out of you. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! The title's going Cover. nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Truly cannot believe that didn't even get a one count. I've lost count of how many times... Uh-oh, submission move. Fujiwara Armbar. Uh, he's in complete control. Opponent has nowhere to go. Could be... Trying to find a way out. And he's out and delivers a knee. Running leg drop. Oh, what a four. Oh, man. Oh, he's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap, very effective. Oh, moonsault. Incredible agility. He heads outside, count outs legal in this match. Face gouge, oh God. Getting carried around back spot to be in. Uh-oh. No! This is going to take some power here. Look at this strength. Absolutely impressive. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Shifts it back onto him. Getting back into the ring. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. The referee counting, urging them to get in the ring. Taken down to the mat. Oh, he's got him by the leg. The foot DDT. Strong right forearm. Oh, what a clubbing blow. Able to get the advantage here. advantage uh oh it's gonna we're gonna see it stop the champ's eyes look glazed over shoulders down he's on the ropes the official sees it and waves off the pen oh waiting for it waiting for it could it be Here's the pin title on the line. Here we go. And that's it. The champion is defeated. Here is your winner. And new WWE United States Champion, Seth. A victory worthy of a new champion. Tonight is definitely a night to celebrate, but let's not lose sight of the fact they have a long road ahead of them now. At least, if they're lucky. Oh, come on, Corey. Don't be such a party pooper. We've got a new champion! The whole effing show. The following is scheduled for one fall 
making his way to the ring from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. From ECW standout to WWE legend, one of the most unique athletes sports entertainment has ever known. You are going to have to go beyond your own limits to overcome the sinister mind of Edge. And here comes the multi-time world champion. Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 250 pounds. Edge! Yeah, Cornerstone, one of the forefathers of the tables, ladders, and chairs match. The ultimate opportunist. And now you're looking at one of the most iconic superstars in the history of sports entertainment, Rob Van Dam. Always a challenging opponent, Byron. Yeah, and what makes Van Dam such a challenge is his knack to risk it all. I expect we'll see him take his opponent to the absolute extreme here tonight. I can't agree with you more, Byron. Van Dam is not to be taken lightly in any situation. Now let's hope he's ready to face off against the one and only Edge. I don't know if anyone can be ready for Edge, Saxton. He's one of the most adaptable superstars WWE has ever known. Edge has the ring presence and chops few people will ever come close to obtaining. Corey, what kind of preparation should an opponent do before getting in the ring with Edge? Well, there's plenty of tape you can study when it comes to Edge, so you need to start there. Learn his timing, plan some counters to his favorite attacks. The possibilities are endless. That's why you always do your homework if you can. Kick right to the back of the leg. Uh-oh, dumped to the outside. What a dive. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spitting in the face of danger. Knee strike connects. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He's got the answer for that one. Perfect time to attack when his guard is down. RVD letting his opponents know who's in charge here. Really pushing the limit there. As long as you're aware, use as much of the rest count as you want. Edge is certainly fighting from behind now. Clearly somebody did their homework, going for carefully planned attacks based on Edge's timing. Wheel barrel, flapjack, face first. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Execution. Edge adapting to the competition and delivering a big maneuver. Spear by Edge. And that can keep RBD down. Cover. Two. Hangs on by a thread. RBD displaying all the fight left in him with that kick out. And Edge is shell shocked. He thought that was the crushing blow he needed. Up high. Missile drop kick. Uh, shot. 
Avoiding contact. Springboard misses the target. Edge predicted that one. Scoop slam. Big knee to the midsection. He must have had that scouted. And RVD being taken to task there. Edge is certainly delivering attacks with more malice as the match goes on. Flapjack! Does he have him here? And referee cuts off the count in one. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Great counter. Impressive ring IQ on display there. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh! Well, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out! Uh, 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 Slight uh, shot! Uh, right across the back of the neck. Ouch. Watch out! Diving leg drop from the top rope! Cover! He's able to beat a two count. Still gonna take a massive effort to keep him down. This match's brutality starting to show on him. Van Dam using whatever avenue of attack he can find. Twists the arm and a kick right to the midsection. Uh-oh. Bang! That was a good shot, and it looks like Van Dam might be bleeding. Edge delivers execution for the win. Two and a kick out of two. Are you kidding me? Look out. Slingshot sent on. Yes. Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. We are beginning to reach a point of desperation in this match. These athletes' bodies can only take them so far. You have to imagine they're reaching their breaking point. And Edge is countered. Boom! Oh, what a drop kick. On the mark. Need to hustle back to the ring. Just a few seconds left. Delivers the cross body. Precision knee. Talk about dismantling your opponent. And we're still seeing the fight left in RVD there. Still being able to take command at this stage says a lot about Van Dam. Face first. Edge caught him there. Taking control. Edge's defenses are being mowed down. Well executed suplex. He snatches Edge. Nice scoop slam. Hoping to end it here. And the count stops short of two. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. Downward spiral. See ya. Big time Savant kick right on point. Well, that'll do some serious damage. And he's able to reverse. Vintage Edge. Edgematic. Opportunist figured out a way to win here tonight.
is a submission match. Making his way to the ring from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 237 pounds, the Superstar. You can see exactly why the arena is full here tonight. This is a match with major stakes. It's fight night! And his opponent from Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic warrior, Sheamus! Nearly 15 years into his WWE career, Sheamus still manages to deliver banger after banger. Okay. After banger. We got it. After banger. Would you stop? After banger. Oh my gosh. After banger. Quiet. After banger. Shut up. After banger. I love it. After banger. <sighs> After banger. All right, here we go. No pinfalls in this one, guys. The only way to beat your opponent is via submission. Neither of these superstars wants to be the one to tap here. Yeah, Corey, I'm guessing we'll see a lot more measured offense in this one. You do not want to be the first one to make a mistake that'll end up ultimately causing you to submit. And that was a rough landing from that toss. Jeez. Uh-oh. Backbreaker. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Exploder suplex. This is just brute power. What a German suplex. Stop in the leg. Ah. Crippling attack on the knee. Byron, some say you don't have to be well-versed in submission moves to have a chance to win this type of match. Do you agree? Well, the odds are not necessarily in your favor, but we have seen in the past superstars who aren't exactly technical masterminds win submission matches. And the only submission that matters is the last one. You can attack that limb any way you want beforehand. In fact, the match is no disqualification, so the options are endless. Oof. Ooh. He's getting a little battered now. Oh. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Ooh, stiff punch. Oh, forearm Damn. smash. Brutal. Counter from the Celtic Warrior. Was mounted with punches and not and a Oof. stomp to the gut too. And he slides him back to the mat. Bro kick! I knew Sheamus had this. Got the legs trapped. Stepped over. Cloverleaf. He's got it locked in. It's locked in. Now would be a wise time to submit. And he's out. Tremendous strength. Rokina Clutch, locked in, 
The official asking him, is he going to tap? The clutch is in. This one could be over. Ah, breaking the grip, breaking the grip, breaking the hold. That's a bad landing. Vicious right forearm. He's one step ahead there. He right to the midsection. Setting them up for the Falcon Arrow. Able to elude it. Look at this display of power. Overhead, belly to belly. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. Oh, the ankle locks in. The ankle locks in. Uh, this one's over. Tap out coming. Whoa, 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 look at that. And somehow he's able to work his way out of the hold. He saw it coming. A little rope assistance punishing their opponent. He's struggling a bit here. Submission matches are all about grinding down your opponent. And that is what we've been seeing all this time. The foot DDT. Oh, saw it coming. Got a forearm. Off the barricade. Crushing knee strike. Boom. Oh, what an uppercut. Sorry. Closed fist punch to the jaw. Oh, there's the Irish curse backbreaker. And the blow kick. Holy cow, a taste of his own medicine. Launched with a suplex. Bash straight into the post on the outside. Stop! And Sheamus there gets struck with another hard-hitting attack. Now, Sheamus could be in some real jeopardy here. Makes it incredibly difficult to walk. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. What are they doing here? From a seated position, this takes tremendous power. Suplex delivered. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? From the top. Elbow drop, good Lord. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Targeting that ankle, ankle lock, he gives up, it's over. It's over. Brutality finally comes to an end. Here is your winner, the Superstar. And with the results of this battle plain to see on their face, at least they can say they won the match. That was an unfair match from the start. The WWE Universe was constantly distracting Sheamus. Oh my gosh, where's the violin?
<laughs> Are you guys ready? The following contest is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring from Aberdeen, Washington, weighing in at 212 pounds, Daniel Bryan. Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have wanted to call this match. I cannot wait to finally do it. A man who elevates his game every week. He is competing at his highest level yet. And his opponent from Yonkers, New York, weighing in at 265 pounds, Tommy. No matter how high the deck is stacked, this one competitor will never give up. Well, as long as never giving up is the only strategy they bring with them into the ring, the odds are they will always be stacked against them. Doesn't matter where or when he's competing, this guy just wants to fight, and he's about to get one. Anything goes in this one-on-one, -on -one, no holds barred match. It is going to be brutal, Michael. I can tell that both competitors will take full advantage of the lawlessness this match provides. Oh, you power bomb! That might be it. Now that's what you call impact. And an elbow drop to the arm. Getting him into the corner. Close line! Off with their head. Uh-oh. Oh, he knew what was coming. Hard drag. Very Ooh. nice. Oh, caught a power ball. That's got to be it. He gets the kick out after the one. Still not enough to put him away. position. Straight impact on the throat. Relentless. Ooh. As easy as it may seem to come into a no-DQ match with no plan other than to get violent, strategy can play a role in this. Now's the time for a superstar to get inventive, to get creative when it comes to inflicting damage on their opponents. Showing him what a real alpha male looks like. Solid punch. Check out this. All the way down. This is just an overwhelming amount of offense on him. Yeah, and this has to decrease his composure moving forward. With the counter. He's trying to bring the fight back in this one. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Drop kick hits the mark. This match grinded him down a little. Down for a European arm breaker. Oh.
And he's just having his way in this match. He's bringing a lot of intensity right now. Clothesline. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. And he gets set back into the ring. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. And now gets tossed into the ring. Yeah, here they come! Pace is picked up! How is this superstar doing this? He thinks he has it! Shoulders shoots up before two. Not even letting the ref get to the two count. Boom, what a forearm. What a counter. Sky high. Way up there. It's that time. A pick drop. Is it enough to secure the victory? Makes the cover. Wow, he's going to celebrate all night long. Here is your winner, Tommy. Wow, just wow. A tremendous win in this match. He was as on top of things as he could possibly be here tonight. And look how it paid off. Here comes the challenge. Oh, oh from the behind, the champion looking for the upper hand. Couldn't even wait for the match to start. And just like that, the challenger's aspirations might have gone up in smoke. Glad to see all the superstars involved have made it into the ring. But this is no longer a fair fight after that shocking assault while making their way to the ring. Just overexcited for this match, that's all. They couldn't stand to wait until they actually got in the ring or it was a calculated plan to get the advantage. Well, I guess we'll just never know. Thrown back in under the ropes. Oh! Backbreaker! Climbing up top, he's got big plans! Here we go, Meteora. He can do it here. What? Oh, he kicked out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Hooked up. Boom. And he is now in a discouraging spot. He somehow has to get himself back in order again. Well scattered reversal there. If he was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Ref, are you blind? He's lost some of his win now. Oh, nice deep arm drag. And will this be it? Fairly kicks out. He thought he had it. Setting him up, got the head scissors on. Sharp elbow. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast and taunt. Knee right to the gut. Got the single arm underhook. Suplex! Oh! Big knockdown. 
Oh, looking for it. Back body drop. Oh, and a spine shoulders down. No, he gets the shoulder up. Almost inhuman at this point. What started out a few short weeks ago with a few choice words has turned into an all-out blood feud between them. This is a level of aggression that few take it to, but when they do, it's all out war. Oh, man, check out this power. Gorilla press slam. He's looking a little off balance. From the top. Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. An absolutely terrible landing ringside. Power slam. He's certainly looking in command at the moment. He's looking relentless. Nice suplex. Vertical suplex. Over and over again, getting beaten down with force. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Play of strength with the suplex. And a kick out at only one. But that won't beat him. Look at this corkscrew plunge out of the floor. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Whoa, wow. Inverted power slam. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Ah, oh, had that well scouted. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Up on the shoulders. Down in a hurry. See ya. Thanks for Makes coming. cover. That will end it. Here is your winner, Why Black. And while a violent attempt was made to prevent this outcome, they stand victorious. What a display of courage, battling to the win against all odds. A lot of people probably thought that sneak attack sealed their fate, but they surprised us. I've been looking forward to this one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York. Weighing in at 275 pounds, The Assassin. Take a look at the talent in competition here. You can see exactly why the WWE Universe is so amped up for this one. Now here's a daunting task he faces. He's not just facing Shawn Michaels. He's got to deal with the support that Michaels has from the entire WWE Universe. I think the ref might be on HBK's side too. It's HBK! And his opponent, representing D-Generation X from San Antonio, Texas, Weighing in at 227 pounds, one half 
of the WWE Tag Team Champions, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. I don't believe there's been a greater performer in the history of WWE than this man, the Heartbreak Kid, Mr. WrestleMania, Shawn Michaels. Without question, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels, has paved the way for countless superstars here in WWE. It may be popular nowadays, but no one has used the super kick quite as well as HBK. And none have ever done it better. And the bell rings for this non-title match. Yes, non-title, but that does not change the fact that depending on the outcome, it could very easily lead to a title shot down the line. Oh, absolutely, Byron. There's still a lot that can be earned here tonight. And across the ring, the iconic Shawn Michaels, considered by many as a revolutionary talent. Great artists take something they see as ordinary and turn it into something extraordinary. That's exactly what Michaels has done since he first stepped foot in WWE. Let's see if HBK will paint the canvas with his opponent here tonight. Bam! to your injury. For Shawn Michaels, we know the experience level, Corey, but what kind of strategy does he need to deploy to have his hands raised at the end of the matchup? The greatest weapon in HBK's arsenal is sweet chin music. As long as Shawn can remain vertical, it can come out of nowhere without warning. It's the ultimate equalizer. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Gotta hurt. Solely focused on... Ooh! Oh, oh, man! Sweet chin music! HBK got all of it. Is it enough? The cover! He stays alive, he stays alive! Just an incredible wherewithal to get the shoulder up. Uh, you would think he'd be out of it after taking that maneuver. And Michaels is so used to any matches like this tonight! is not going to be an easy one for HBK. This rivalry has gotten so personal, so intense. A oh, bear hug, squeezing the breath out of them. Oh, body is not meant to bend. Oh, the bear hug, and a way to get out of it is being on display right here. Michael's got it all with the flying forearm. The wherewithal to counter HBK. He's going for it all. From the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. Cover. Two count. Wards off the pin at two. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Shoulder. This is it. Guys, look, what, what oh my goodness. And going for a ride with a massive choke slam. What an impact made.
the toughest SOB in WWE history. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, one half of the World Tag Team Champions, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Watch your five hole, Saxton. Anybody see my ice pack? Austin, trademark scowl on his face. The biggest anti-hero in WWE history. Stone Cold Steve Austin says what he wants, does what he wants, and he's not afraid of the repercussions. And his opponent, representing Air Boom from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 180 pounds, Evan Boom. This superstar has no hobbies, no stress relievers, nothing outside of WWE. That is the secret to their success and the adoration from the WWE Universe. Well, that's just up until the WWE Universe realizes how one-dimensional this dud right here is. I'm such a pessimist. Byron, how do you stop Austin from raising total hell? Listen, you've got to be the best version of yourself, and even that might not be enough to overcome Stone Cold. And here's a superstar who clearly has no shortage of courage. Well, the line between bravery and stupidity is a very fine one, and there's a strong argument that this competitor is crossing it by stepping up to the champ. Here's the cover. Now Austin's still alive. Not even a near fall there. What a punch. Austin with a reversal. Austin, uh-oh. He skirts around it. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Uh -oh. Carefully measured. Uh-oh. Was ready for that. What a forearm shiver. Look at the handstand elbow drop. And now the... Now just attacking the opponent's back. Stone Cold avoids the attack. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Ooh! -hoo. Austin loves to bring the fight to his opponents, loves to raise hell. Yeah, and he loves to have a Stone Cold style match. Non-stop brawling. But if you want to succeed against him, you can't let him have control of the match like that. Oh, the knee takes a big hit. Oh, kick connects. He's absorbed some damage already. DDT! Is it enough? And he gets the shoulder up before two. He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Not so fast on the comeback trail. He's got more fight in him than a junkyard dog. Drop kick. Beautiful. <laughs> Caught with a punch. Uh-oh, look at what are they going to do? Oh, right to the face. Right to the back of the neck. And again. Enough. Clubbing blows. Got Austin back. Oh, 
at this. Oh, from the rope. Austin reminding him that Stone Cold is not someone to take lightly. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, Austin always won to make a statement with offense like that. The stop in the leg. Just nasty. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Hurricane run. Oh, no, no, no. We're going to see something else. How about a power bomb? Stone Cold Steve Austin hammered away with the right hand. He can end it here. And a kick out at two. Just barely, but it counts. I think we all know what's coming from Austin. Stone Cold Stunner. Austin got all of it. He kicked out at two. I can't believe it. This whole arena's in shock. Yeah, but no one's more shocked than the man who thought he had a pinfall. And Austin is in a state of disbelief. From the top. Oh, misses the mark. He steers clear of contact. DDT. Hurricanrana, ideal meal. There's the bulldog. He is mentally and physically exhausted now. Not what you want to see by any means. Big time power bomb. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Oh, that might have just broken something. Austin just stomping away. Austin building up speed. Oh, right to the heart. The Texas Rattlesnake's humming now. Austin's opened up a can of you-know-what. Just rake in the face. Face rake, this is nasty. He turns it around. Yeah, he's able to stop that surge dead in its tracks. Hurricane on. Oh, this will rearrange your face in a hurry. Right across the face. Multiple kicks connect. Hurricane Rana. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. That's it. Austin able to get the win. Here is your winner. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Well, that came out of nowhere and an unexpectedly quick end to this match. Clever is really the only word that can describe that victory. However you want to describe it, it certainly worked. Ah, oh, the king of hardcore. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Weighing in at 287 pounds. One half of the world tag team champions, Cactus Jack.
I mean, Cactus Jack has literally left body parts in rings all around the world. Yeah, this is a dude who's seen more blood in his career than a horror film director. Imagine how you got to feel if you're Cactus Jack's opponent. This guy is the real deal. And his opponent, representing Air Boom from Jamaica, weighing in at 212 pounds, the Superstar. Gentlemen, I think this one's going to turn into a fight in a hurry, and I cannot wait. Well, he's going to have to become a completely different person just to withstand the brutality of Cactus Jack. And remember, this is a nine-title match, but still a high-stakes affair for the champion's opponent tonight. For the sake of pride alone, this is a must-win match on both sides. Neither man can take each other lightly. I hope for their sake that neither of them will. And in the other corner is Mrs. Foley's baby boy. This man has fought through it all. Barbed wire, thumbtacks, flaming tables, and he's got the scars to prove it. I really hope things don't go that far in the ring tonight, Corey, but you never know with the hardcore legend Cactus Jack. Drop kick! Karana, ideal meal. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. Neck breaker! Measured kick to the vertebrae. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly, staved off that attack. Incredible power slam. Dangerous intentions on the mind of the madman. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Only getting one out of that pin. Just using the cover to drain out some energy. Ooh, vicious kick to the spine. Crank in the head. Oh, God, that hurt. And Cactus Jack is looking a little less dangerous after that attack. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Ow! Oh, man, look at Cactus Jack's face turning into a mangled mess. Uppercut. Cactus Jack is having problems here. This is what you have to do to shake up Cactus Jack. Give him everything you've got and hold nothing back. Big, big, big. We got a cover. And kicks out before the count. He's looking to get this match won in short order. Now look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Look, the most intelligent. The sleeper hold is cinched in. Time to go night night. Sleeper hold locked in. Tap out. Do it now. Sleeper hold is cinched in. Oh my goodness. Not for long. Uh oh. SOS. Into the pin attempt. Two. And a kick out. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. Are you kidding me? That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Whatever's playing here can't be good. He's taking some good hits. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Cactus Jack has it locked in. That's it. The blood and sweat put into this match. Well worth it. Here is your winner, Cactus Jack. You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory.
The reward definitely seems greater than the risk right about now, but we'll see how they feel once they get back to the locker room and hit the showers. The following contest is an eight-man ladder match. That is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Introducing the challenger from Houston, Texas, weighing in at 414 pounds, Mark Henry. This is big, guys, as the Money in the Bank contract is on the line here tonight. Which means that, statistically, the winner of this match will likely go on to become champion. This is a man who makes the most of every opportunity, and this is his biggest opportunity ever. Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, the Superstar. One of the most anticipated matches in ages, the Intercontinental Championship is on the line. It's been a long time coming, and these men will do whatever it takes to capture the prestigious Intercontinental title. The challenger looking determined. He will need the performance of a lifetime to become champion. And from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 253 pounds. Chris Ben who guys we have incredibly high stakes here tonight in this ladder match and it's because of those stakes that I suspect these superstars will do just about anything to be the first one to climb the ladder and grab the gold The challenger about to compete in a career-altering championship match. He is ready. Weighing in at 227 pounds, 
Santana Marcella. The Money in the Bank contract is set, and we're ready to go here. You call it a contract, Cole. I call it a winning lottery ticket. It's not very often you actually get a chance to hold a winner in your hands. But tonight, one of these superstars will do just that. He's been waiting a very long time for this title opportunity. I hope he's ready. Uh, Saxton, stop dancing. I can't help it. It's like my hips and my hands have a mind of their own. And from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 425 pounds, Rikishi! Not only an all-time great, but the father of Jimmy and Jey Uso, the real person responsible for their tag team prowess, Saxton. And their dance moves, too. Hey, guys, you think Rikishi would give me a dance lesson? Absolutely not, Saxton. With any luck, you'll get a stink face. No, no. Rikishi wouldn't do that to me. One of the OGs of the bloodline and the pride of Samoa. <laughs> and he'll back it up in more ways than one. He is simply phenomenal. <laughs> you said it, Michael. A phenomenal resume, phenomenal skills, and without a doubt, a phenomenal performer. And from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. AJ Styles is an athlete who many would argue possesses the best all-around skill set in WWE. Styles has an unmatched drive to win. Undeterred passion, fire, and desire. And we're going to see it on display tonight, courtesy of the Phenomenal One. You know, being known as Phenomenal, that's just the beginning. Well, anytime AJ Styles is in the ring, you have to almost assume that it's going to turn into an instant classic. Yeah, another one's imminent tonight. And from parts unknown, weighing in at 215 pounds, Gregory. Just moments away, title on the line. How do you think things are going to shake out in this Intercontinental Championship match? Something in my bones is telling me we are about to see a new champ. I can feel it. I actually think we're going to see the Intercontinental Champion retain. Oh, that's cute, Saxon. Good thing nobody asked you. He is physically prepared. He is mentally prepared. This man is ready for this title opportunity.
from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds. He is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, CM Punk. Ladies and gentlemen, the title will be hanging high above the ring here tonight in what promises to be an incredible ladder match. As we've seen in the past, the ladder will likely become more than just a set of steps used to reach the championship. There's a good chance we'll see it used as a weapon as well. Many have written him off as champion, but he is determined to prove his doubters wrong. So much history attached to the Intercontinental Championship. So much weight attached to this match. Yeah, but right now it's all about living in the present, in the now. That's the only way the champ's gonna get out of this with his title in tow. And that was a well-executed attack. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Whipped over in a snap suplex. Samoan driver. Oh, look at this. What a headbutt. And he's able to counter. Oh, man, he is fired up now. This is right forearm. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. Counters this. Could be an opportunity. Oh, right to the kidneys. Oh, a lot of damage can be done in a ladder match. Corey, is there any way you can mitigate that factor? I'd have to say that speed is everything here, Cole. The faster you are or can be, the more easily you can duck, dodge, and die. If you can avoid taking the same amount of damage as everyone else, you can have the upper hand. And then you can also use that speed to climb. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. Scaling the ladder now. Kendo stick to the skull. I don't have you walking funny. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. God, I wonder what he's thinking about when he sets it up here. Uh-oh. A stutter! Got the head scissors cinched in, and here come the elbows. And there was some force on that move. Move it into an arm breaker. Climb. Go for it. Climb. He's trying for it now. Got to act fast. Nobody in this building thinks the match can end here. I think so. Go home. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. Ooh -hoo -hoo. And we can't overlook how devastating that DDT was. And now thrown back into the ring. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Saw it coming and slowed it down with the back elbow. Tough position to be caught in here. Nice side headlock applied. Ooh -hoo. And right hand for good measure. The challenger eating up some damage. Belly to belly. On the DDT. Ah, oh, the reversal by Rikishi. Dropkick finds the spot. Great response to AJ there. He's setting up the ladder for something, guys. Yeah, the question is, what is that something? Ah, oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Great reversal. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. There's nothing off limits. Nope. Into a gut buster. Nice. Drives a foot into the stomach. Big knee to the midsection. Ooh, man. He must have seen that coming. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. DDT. Full Nelson applied. Up and down. Like Saxton Asian, but better. Climbing the ladder now. He better work quickly here. And Cole, a win here would be so incredibly huge. Yes, we have a new champion.
Here's your winner and new WWE Intercontinental Champion, Gregory. The outlast of the opposition climbed every rung, grabbed the prize.